It's not a typical typical winter in the Green Mountain State. Some days are below freezing and great for getting out on the ice, while others are hitting above freezing, causing some danger with ice melting potential. Our Jessica Tara spoke with officials to see how to prepare if you do head out in icy conditions. From 10 degree weather to now 30 degrees, this winter has some Vermonters confused. This year's the weather seems kind of strange. The last few years the weather seems to be getting stranger. You know, I don't know if uh, uh, it's because we're warming up more and more and more or what, but um, yeah, it seems to be a little bit more erratic than what it's been uh, what it's been years ago. Prescott Natto of the Williston Fire Department says people expect to be out on the ice, ice fishing, recreating, just having a good time. And in the past years, that's been the case around this time of year. A week ago, we had freezing temperatures that definitely put a solid freeze in some areas of Lake Champlain, but it didn't do a solid job. And I mean that pun intended. He says if the temperatures drop significantly again, it is vital to be prepared. Our number one recommendation is as soon as the temperatures do uh, begin to, to get to a freezing point and, and drop that lake temperature such that things freeze over, um, check the ice depth frequently. Natto says grab a spot bar, auger, and make sure people recognize that ice doesn't freeze uniformly and remember the basics like getting proper equipment. Make sure you have those ice picks with you so if, if um, you do fall through the ice, you have a means to get yourself out. Another tip is to make sure you have a charged cell phone in case somebody does fall in. You have the option to make a call and to put your phone in a protective case or water bag to make sure it's safe. Another important tool to keep with you is a throw bag of rope. A lot of people have the ice picks for themselves, but recognizing a throw bag of rope might be a life-saving tool uh, for a friend, a colleague, or just you know someone who may have fallen on tough times and fallen through the ice. Um, you might be the one that can help uh, get them out. Natto says if you don't know, don't go. No ice is 100% um, safe, and and therefore you know if you if you can't. Uh, make make a good estimation of the of the um, thickness of that ice and make sure that you know whether you're walking out on it going ice fishing recreating in any form if you don't know uh, don't go it's just not worth the risk as for don walter he's not missing the negative temperatures i don't mind it because I, I i like the warmer weather so it's not it's not too bad reporting in south burlington jessica tara channel 3 news